everyone, Jonathan here. Welcome back to Savoring the Magic. I am here solo today in Epcot. Molly is out of town, but it's the very first day of the Communicore Plaza and Hall and all the surrounding areas. So come along with me today for this long time coming excursion. So the announcement about the reimagining of Epcot was made at D23 in 2019. And here we are coming into the summer of 2024. And this is the very last project to be completed. So as we walk over here, let's take a moment of silence to remember all the things that we have lost. But in all seriousness, I'm just glad at this point that Epcot is no longer just a big dirt pile with construction walls around it. So as we come up here, the very first thing that you're gonna see is the Mickey and Friends meet and greet area. And there's this huge mural that's back there. We'll kind of get a better look at that later. Sorry. No worries. There's a lightning lane and a standby entrance here. And up here at the front is also the Festival Favorites booth. Right now, this is serving some menu items inspired by Encanto. I'll try to get a better view of the menu here in a minute. And this is the back of the plaza stage. So the Encanto show, from the best that I've heard, is going to have about six show times during the day. And then they're going to have some live entertainment here in the evenings uh, in place of the Encanto sing-along. They do have some uh, covered seating over here on the side. Well, some nice tables. Although right now, at this time of the day, the heat is a little brutal. I'm going to pop back out here in a second when the show starts, show you a little bit of that. And I have AstroTurf lined out here and some umbrellas, but it is a warm day to be sure. And over here to the left of the stage, there are some restrooms over there. And then let's pop into the actual Communicore Hall here in just a second. And there's the long awaited entry over there to Imagination Pavilion. Here we go. Okay. So there's obviously just a lot of seating in here at the moment. This is a big flex space. So as they have actual festivals in here, I'm assuming there will be lots of different things in here. Right now, it's just a lot of seating and much needed air conditioning. These covered panels here is actually where the test kitchen is behind it. So these will open up. I think there's some footage from the event the other night we could probably find. Detail I did notice, looks like they have a way of closing this off. Uh, here on the sides, there's a roller where they can kind of direct traffic into that main section so neat little detail okay here we are back out to the other side that is the back side of the moana restrooms over there
Here's a closer look at some of that mural. Nice shot of horizons, living seas, mission space. Of course, the monorail. Some nice retro Epcot throwbacks there. And at least that main standby queue is in the shade, so that's nice. Hola a todos. Por favor, denme la bienvenida al escenario a la calle. It's a surprisingly dead night here, so it's a five minute wait for Spaceship Earth. So, let's go board one of my favorite attractions. Shout out to my favorite right there. There he is. Sleeping on the job. the greatest question of all does this child have a face i want to know another completed project is the wall behind walt just was kind of behind uh, bushes or uh, I don't know since this opened so it is finally done very similar kind of uh, shapes textures as some of the other things in World Celebration 
Nice little detail work. But it is nice for this not to be rolling planters. So, one more addition complete. So a show that doesn't get talked about enough is actually Awesome Planet Inside the Land. I popped in here long enough to uh, wait for it to get dark. And I think that show is really a really good blending of what Epcot used to be as far as education and entertainment. The only thing it's missing is a really nice 80s ballad at the end. So plus it up, you know? So over here we're going to check out the lights on the new Communicore Hall and the Mickey and Friends and the whole structure. So let's check it out. So that does it for me here at Epcot with the new Communicore Plaza and Hall. Let me know in the comments your thoughts of the new area and now the final completion of Epcot's overall. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. It really helps us out. We have videos coming out every week. But until next time, keep savoring the magic.